The UAE is an amazing, luxurious country. Unfortunately, that luxury comes at a cost, as the UAE is quite an expensive country. Thankfully, there are loads of amazing apps and websites that can help you save money. So within this video, we're going to be looking at all of those different apps and websites that I have found that can save money. If you don't know who I am, my name is Thomas Blakemore and I'm a teacher here in Dubai. I make lots of videos about teaching in Dubai, but also lifestyle videos for the UAE too. So let's jump straight into the video. Okay, so app number one is The Entertainer. You've probably already heard of The Entertainer. It is probably one of the most popular money saving apps out there. It is the thing that I use the most to help me save money within the UAE, which is why I'm starting with it. So it is something that you have to pay a little bit of money towards at the start of the year. I recommend paying for it in December because then you get a bit of the year before and then the year after too. Uh, I have saved double, if not triple, the amount that I initially paid for it, which shows that that initial payment, that initial investment is worthwhile. And it's basically full of a range of different two for one offers. This works fantastic if you regularly go for meals with a partner, uh, with a family of four, for example, or something along those lines. It really can stack up with those savings. There's lots of different food, different drink, different entertainment, two for one deals. So it's worth checking out. From there, app number two is HSBC Entertainer. Now this is free if you have a specific HSBC credit card. Now this is a slightly more limited version of the official entertainer, but because it's free, it works really well and you're suddenly saving money if you're going out for meals with someone else as that bit of a two for one. It also works really nicely as a bit of a stack. What I mean by that is if you also have the entertainer and you run out of codes for one restaurant that you particularly like, Nando's, I'm gonna throw it out there, British, all that sort of stuff. And then you've also got that HSBC entertainer to fall back on to make those additional savings. So that one's also available if you have a specific HSBC credit card that I'll put down here. Priceless Specials app. This works in a similar manner to the entertainer. In fact, it has a very similar feel. This is something that I've been advised about. It's not something I use myself but because it's to do with MasterCard and many people will have a MasterCard credit card. It is something that is available within the Middle Eastern region. It's going to give you a range of different two for one offers similar to the entertainer. And again, could be stacked to make those additional savings. It's worth checking out. So have a look at that. The next app is Blue Rewards. I've already made a video about Blue Rewards. Blue Rewards is essentially an app that helps you collect points. Now, that is not the single reason I like Blue Rewards, although it is great to collect points. Points means prizes, and in the UAE, that it often means additional money. You have a range of two for one. Now, you have to unlock it. I have made a separate video about how to unlock it at the cheapest rate. For about 10 dirhams, you can then suddenly unlock a range of different two for one deals. Now, this is even more limited in terms of the restaurants available on there. However, it's still additional savings on a range of different restaurants that you can easily check out. So that's available too. The next app is Share Rewards. Share Rewards is a bit of a points app. What I mean by that is you can spend in a range of different shops. It's usually the Majid Alpha Tame malls that you can collect these in uh, and Carrefour you can also collect this with. Share Rewards allows you to spend money and collect points. Those points again add up to a certain amount of money that can then be claimed. The other reason I like Share Rewards is because there are, it's a little section that also has a range of different deals. I've used this in the past for Ski Dubai for specific deals and, and that's made a big saving, which is really useful um, every time I go to the cinema. It saves me a little bit of money like that. There's also a range of additional discounts that I've just not used, but it is worth checking out. As a teacher, I have to mention teacher socials. This is full of a range of percentage discounts. For example, I went to the Claw near Dubai Mall in Souq al Bahar. They have a 50% discount and that is on food and drinks if it's not on the happy hour menu. And that saved me quite a significant amount. There's also a range of other percentage discounts on that app. You do need to be a teacher, but again, it's great because it saves you money, money that you might not be able to save on some of the other apps that I've mentioned. Repeat, I have only just recently started using Repeat. I think I used it at a restaurant that advertised it and they didn't have something along the lines of entertainer. Essentially what happens is the more you use the restaurant, the more you go to the restaurant, the higher the saving is going to be. So let's say, you go to a restaurant, there's an initial saving of 30%. If you go to that restaurant again within a week, then you save 
30% again. If you go to that restaurant again within two weeks, then it's a slightly lower amount of percentage saved. What that does is encourage repeat business. It's really good if you have that favorite restaurant that you know that you go to every single week, because then you can use that app and keep those savings nice and high. It's also good just if you use it as a bit of a one-off, because they will often have a high initial savings to try and get you into the restaurant, and then you can make those savings, even if it's just going there for a one-off. Air miles. I am terrible at collecting air miles. However, I know that there will be people out there who are avid air miles collectors and also fly all around the world on business class because of their air miles. There is an app that can help you save more air miles by shopping in a range of different shops. That way you can build up your air miles and potentially spend them on airlines or other things. Smiles app. I have been told by many people that the Smiles app is extremely useful if you don't already have something along the lines of the entertainer. The Smiles app has a range of different two for one offers that you need to pay a small amount to unlock. Let's say you go to Krispy Kreme Donuts, for example, you would then pay three Durham or something along those lines to unlock the two for one offer and then use it at that point, which is then going to still save you that little margin on your going out bill for food uh, and other things like that. The Smile app also allows you to collect points as you're going to. Clip the deal. Now, Clip the deal is kind of like couponing in America, if you've heard of that. So it means that when you go to a shop, let's say Choice Rooms, and you see there's save a durham, a couple of durham on milk, you can collect those points and then you can tap on what you're using. The person at the till will then use the app and then those points are then collected within the app that you can collect at your own discretion. Finally, Let's DXB. I've used Let's DXB a few times to save money on a range of different brunches. So what this will do is offer you a 30% discount, a 50% discount on specific brunches. It's also a really useful app to see what different brunches are available at certain times, whether it's a Thursday night or a Friday afternoon, then you can see those ones and if there are any offers available. That marks the end of the app section. Now let's move on to websites. So to start off with, you've got Groupon. Now Groupon is internationally recognized. It's fantastic for things to do. Let's say you've got something in mind that you want to do, you can type it in and then see if there is a bit of a discount and then you can pay for that specific voucher that you paid X amount for and that will unlock something. I really like using it for the breakfast and pool days. It can be a varying amount based on adults and children and all those sorts of things. You'll pay X amount and then that unlocks the coupon that allows you to go to some really cool restaurants for breakfast and pool day afterwards. So that's worth checking out. In addition to that, you've got something similar, which is Kaban. They are very similar to Groupon, but what that will do is unlock some other deals that might not be available on Groupon. With both websites, you also have things like pay 25 Durham for 50 Durham's worth of credits, which almost works out to be a bit of a, a half price thing if you manage to pay exactly 50 Durham for that. So you're only paying 25 Durham for that item at the shop that's 50 Durham, as an example. Both of those are very strong money-saving websites that are worth checking out. Finally, Facebook groups. There are a range of different Facebook groups that can help you save money. So to start off with, you've got secondhand groups. There will be people who want to sell things secondhand and that can help you save money initially. There are a range of different groups and I'm gonna sit and list them, there's loads. Finally is a really strong group that I have found to help save money and that's called shop well for less this was set up not too long ago but it's really grown rapidly one of the rules of the group is if you share any form of advertisement then you must make sure that you share a coupon code a discount code so what you end up with is lots of people sharing different coupon codes there's also times that people will go to the shops and say oh this is available in these shops for this amount and what that does is create a community of people who are like-minded and want to save money so feel free to check that one out as well I went on there to try and find out some more apps and websites and found a couple of websites that I've included within this video too. I hope this has been a useful video for you. I'm really fingers crossed that this will save you some money in the future. This is the part where I hand over to the sponsor of the video. That, that's me, I, I, I'm the sponsor. This has come from a section of my guide about moving to the UAE that's all about apps, specifically money saving apps. So if you are interested in moving to the UAE, check out my website teachtraveltriumph.com forward slash guide and that will have a few different guides about teaching in the UAE 
and there's sections within one of the guides about saving money. So feel free to check that one out. If you're new around here, I create a range of videos about lifestyle in Dubai, UAE, and also teaching too. So feel free to subscribe to the channel, like the video if you haven't already, and hopefully I will see you in the next one. Until then, I'm out.